What's up guys, it's your boy from Messiah. So, in today's video, as you saw by the title, we're gonna be trying to gain muscle in one day. So I know that most of you think, oh, it's not possible, it's clickbait, whatever. I promise you it's not clickbait, right? Literally, how I plan to do this is, well, I'm gonna break it down first. get into it so essentially <clears throat> it looks like I've lost muscle so basically the reason for that is I was sick for the last two weeks I've been pretty badly sick for the last week I had to be like bedridden like I haven't been training for over a week so my muscles look visibly smaller right however it's pretty much impossible within that time frame to have lost actual muscle fiber because the thing is well let's get a drawing quick right you got a mountainous bicep peak, right? You have the actual muscle fiber, right? That, yeah, all of that stuff there. Muscle fibers. But then, water. So when you don't train for like a few weeks or even like a week or so, You'll start losing water within the muscle, you start losing glycogen and other things which will make your muscle look visibly smaller. When you train, you work on getting the muscle fibres larger, right? Um, so, no actual muscle fibres have been lost in these two weeks. It's actually just all water, which is easy to get back. Luckily, it is just water. If it was actually muscle fibres, that would take quite a bit longer, but then we do have muscle memory. But luckily, I'm thinking it's just water. So, my plan for today is, if I can get as much water and carbohydrates in me as possible, train, do a bit of fluff and pump, obviously, just get the blood into the muscle, I should be able to get back a lot of the lost water from my muscles, because you guys, the last thing I did was a transformation, I'm not sure if you guys know what my physique looks like right now, but obviously, ah. Considering I haven't trained for over a week, uh, I think I'm looking decent. Um, but yeah, it's gonna pump some carbohydrates and water into the muscle and see if we can increase the size a little bit. So yeah, gonna kill some food today. What's going on here? Breakfast! Check that out. I used to out. love this park when I was younger. Literally, it's right by my house. You can see your house. Should we go to where our house is and call Ashley to come and look at us? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like, we could go that tree, watch that tree right over there. I used to love that tree. Let's climb all over it. Uh, I love these foresty areas. I like the area we live in. You like the area we live in? Yeah. I like it. Oh, wait, I, like it. Ooh. Right, okay, let's go. We'll clean up this old car over here. It'll actually be very aesthetic, wouldn't it? It's got that old vintage car. Why? Don't, don't, what's wrong with you? you? Don't put K on the car. You think it's straight? No, no, no. I'm not joking with you. I'm So yeah guys, we start the day off with some Cornwall porridge, but I never recorded that, and I had that with like two slices of toast. So that was a good bit of carbs, but obviously I never got on camera. But yeah, so now we're just gonna kill this meal. So we have got two burgers. Uh, I don't actually eat red meat very often at all, maybe 
once every two months, once every month or so. Um, but today I just felt like a burger. Got some chips, some ketchup, and yeah, I'm just gonna watch something I don't know quite what yet. Uh, you guys haven't seen my room situation. When I when I clean it up, I'll show you. But yeah, basically this is my new room. Uh, but I don't want to show you all of it because it's messy. Alright, so I'm about to head out to the gym. Uh, yeah, killed that meal earlier. Uh, as you saw, I made that French toast. I'm gonna eat that for dessert later. And yeah, I've just been drinking loads of water. Um, and yeah, for this session, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go super hard and heavy because I am still quite sick. But I just want to get some stimulation. Uh, try and get some more blood in the muscle. So yeah, just gonna have a quick banana. Uh, get some energy before I go to the gym. I don't want to have any caffeine at this point because it's after eight, and I don't want to be up late because the caffeine lasts like the effects of it last for like I think four to six hours. I think something like that. Um, so yeah, I don't want to be still up at like twelve one. So yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we've got some chicken wings from my mother. Uh, we've got some brown rice. The next day. Alright, what's up, guys? It's the next morning. I'm feeling a bit fuller, um, but I'm gonna try and get a big meal in. And yeah, we're gonna see if I look any bigger than I did yesterday. I think I do, to be honest, because yesterday I was a bit more depleted than I was today. And I think through getting all those carbohydrates and getting all that blood into the muscle, I think I filled, filled myself out a little bit more. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see.
right, so this is breakfast right here. We got some French toast, we got some eggs, we got some apple juice, we got some maple syrup. I don't like putting maple syrup on like when I'm not about to eat it. I like putting it on like straight away because otherwise it will absorb in there and then, yeah, I like it to be wet. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, and I'm gonna have some cereal after this. And yeah, man. <coughs> All right, guys, it's time to see do I look bigger than I did yesterday? We're gonna see. I'm not gonna get a pump. I'm gonna use the same, I'm gonna be in the same place I was yesterday and we're gonna see, we're gonna see if I look bigger. You guys told me. Alright guys, I think it's fair to say I do look noticeably bigger uh, and the reason for that is as I said, yesterday I was flat and depleted so by getting in all that water, all those carbohydrates and by training I think I was able to fill up my muscles a bit more, get a bit more water and um, glycogen in them so they do look noticeably fuller. Of course, I haven't put on any actual muscle fibers because gaining muscle doesn't come that fast. You have to put in a lot more work and it takes a lot longer for actual muscle to be gained. When it comes to water and glycogen, those things can vary from day to day, which can actually have a big effect on how you look. So, <coughs> by manipulating those, you can use those to advantage. So this little experiment kind of goes to show that you can actually make changes to your physique in just one day and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you found it informative or anything like that give me a comment a like a subscribe either way with that i'm gonna end off the video thank you guys for watching peace <laughs>